What's up? What's up? Damn, my headphones are echoing. How do we do this? Take this out. I'm just walking. Lily was just sent out plans this morning. I was bored. I'm like, let me go on a walk. It's supposed to be 90 today. It's probably about 80 right now here in Hollywood area. And let me just go on a walk. I don't know what that means. Are you 20 yet? What's that mean? What is up? What is up? Where are y'all at? What's the weather like? Where are y'all at? It's nice. Nice, nice, nice here. Comment y'all's questions. I have no topic at hand today. I'm just like, let me go live. See what y'all got. Answer some questions. I'm just in a chill mood today. Not really turned up yet. <laughs> just going on a nice cool walk. Chilling out. Syracuse in the building. What's the weather like in New York? Is it cold in New York? You feel fat? Well, you got to make a change. It is time to make a change so you don't feel fat anymore. You get the confidence back. You feel comfortable in your own skin. You go shopping for the clothes you like. This is my next whip. I but They're so common here. I, I don't like having the same car as everybody else. I just like that the doors go up, the butterfly doors. I'm thinking that might be my next car, but it's so it don't got any back seats though. I hate that. Yeah, it's like no back seat. And I was going to get Corvette, same thing. It's only two seats, not even like a small back row. So that's why before I had a Camaro, before I totaled that in Utah when I lived there, hydroplane on the highway, going 80. So it wasn't my time. That was before I got into even teaching like this. That was before I started my TikTok. Actually, that was when I like first started my TikTok, but I wasn't really touching on holistic health yet. So it wasn't my time to go because I hydroplane. I was probably I was going like between 70 and 80 on the highway in Utah. Totaled my Camaro, wheel fell off, was in the fast lane, and all of a sudden it was like sprinkling. I had new tires and everything. It was crazy. I don't just. Bang, banged into the median, bounced out into the far lanes. Luckily, I was still conscious. I like swerved it over and purposely ran back into the median and slid up the median just so I wouldn't cause a whole pile up. It was crazy. But yeah, anyways. Let's see. Get a, a Jeep Trailhawk, huh? That's not my swag. <laughs> That's not my swag. Uh, let's see. I'm skinny fat, any tips? You got to get your body fat percentage down. That's all there is to it. Get your body fat percentage down. Higher reps. Did I put a filter on? I don't know. It looked weird. Higher reps, short rest periods. You could do circuit training. Cardio after your resistance training. Got to get that body fat percentage down. Make sure you're in a caloric deficit. No, I was never in the military. You don't need back seats when you have a bed. <laughs> need to lose 35 pounds. Kind of just went over that. Take the steps. Get on with it. Stop playing games. The biggest thing that sets people back is waiting to get started. So if you go to a gym, get in there, get it in, but make sure you're doing the right thing. If you got a higher trainer at the gym, hire a trainer at the gym. If you need to set up custom coaching with me, set it up. Because the biggest mistake people make is they get a gym membership. They're going seven days, 10 times a week, meaning they're doing two a days, some days. A month goes by and they haven't got any results. Then they're upset. And they give up and then they start again next January. So just because you're going every day, 
but you're doing the wrong things, it's like spinning your wheels. It's like a hamster, like a hamster wheel. You're running as hard as you can, but nothing's changing. You get frustrated because you're still in the same spot and you get out of the damn wheel, right? Which most people don't want, and that's why people don't get the re- get the results they need because they have no game plan, they have no structure. You're just freestyling, doing random exercises, doing random workouts you've seen on Instagram, following a random meal plan you found on bodybuilding.com or weightloss.com. Like, this is the issue. Low-carb diet, low carb diet is fine, but then people get scared. Like, oh, I can't have fruit because it's got carbs. Or I can't have an onion because it's got carbs. That's when it gets ridiculous because people think because they're doing low-carb that you're going to lose weight. You can do low-carb and still struggle to lose weight, which I see every day with the messages and comments I get of people saying, I've been doing low-carb for three, six, nine months, and nothing's changed. It's more to it than just low-carb. Let's see. No, I don't eat any type of meat. Shout out to Toronto. So all that healthy living, then you speed in your car. Again, I was not speeding. The speed limit was 75. I was going about 70 or 75. So you sound dumb. Lost 30 pounds in three weeks just eating natural foods, veggies, and fruits. Good work, good work. Let's see. How much else questions? I'm just scrolling through questions today. No specific topic on my mind. If you're 57 and sedentary, then get moving. That's the suggestion. Because as you're getting up in age and you're not moving, you're working a sedentary job or you're sitting on the couch all day. It's only a matter of time before the next time you get up, it's harder to get up. Then every time you get up, month after month, year after year, it gets harder and harder. You walk up a flight of stairs, it's harder and harder. So it's time to reverse that and start getting moving. Thank you. Thanks, Mark Bryan. Easy way to start eating healthy is fasting first. Let's see. Best skin and hair food. There's no one food for that. You want to make sure you're getting the right amount of minerals. Most people, when they're dealing with a lot of hair loss randomly or skin issues, they're lacking minerals because the average, especially American diet, they're only getting an average of about 45 to 65 minerals. Your body needs above 90 minerals to function at a high level, which almost no one is getting, right? And out of those 90 minerals, you should be getting essential minerals. These are things they don't teach you, right? That's why I teach you how to heal fibroids. I talk about this on my lives all the time. Black Mission figs. All figs are pretty good. Turkish figs, all those. But if you're dealing with fibroids, eat Black Mission figs daily. It'll shrink your fibroids. No, I was not in college in Utah. I did not go to college. I don't need to learn the same information or teaching everybody, which is causing the world to be in a bad situation. So I don't need to go to college to learn the health and nutrition curriculum they want me to learn. I'll learn myself because all they're teaching is the same stuff that has people in a cycle of getting sick, right? Because when I go to college, they're going to teach me that I need to have chicken breast for my protein. They're going to teach me I need to have red meat for my um, iron, right? Which I don't ever want to be taught that because that's going to cause me to continue to be sick. Let's see, let's see. I don't recommend wheatgrass. Get more minerals in your diet through eating fruits, veggies, sea moss, bladderwrack, burdock root, 
All that, you're going to get all the minerals you need. You can literally live off of sea moss and bladder rack combined. With just water, you'd be good. In severe cases, there may be a point where I need to have someone fast for 30 days on nothing but water and sea moss and bladder rack. Right? But they'll tell you, oh, you can only live on just water for so long or you'll die. Meanwhile, there's people who will do 90 day fast on just water and sea moss, bladder rack, burdock root, other herbs, depending on what they're dealing with, because every herb is going to affect someone different and it's going to heal a different area of the body in combination with other herbs. Let's see, let's see. the best water to drink i did a whole live on that literally like three days ago so if you missed that live follow me on youtube same name just search sea walk talk on youtube and you will see that video i have two different videos i did two separate lives one was like a month ago where i did a live on the best water to drink a full presentation i had them all there with me and then um like three days ago, I did another shorter version of that. Dang, it's really hot in the sun. I should have stayed on that street. It's a hot day. Getting that vitamin D, the best source of vitamin D you can get is from the sun. Yup, if you want custom coaching, I get so many like comments daily. On, hey, I want to get set up with coaching. But the video that the people that, that you all comment on is literally telling you how to get set up for coaching. But then I'll get 100 comments saying, hey, I want to get started. How do I get set up for coaching? You literally just click the link in the bio. TikTok will ask you, are you sure you want to leave? This website might be insecure. That's what they're going to say. I have a completely secure website. They don't want you to leave TikTok. You click it, you'll see the drop down custom coaching, one on one healing consultations. You'll see the detox, 30 day detox and reset program. That's all there for you. Link is in the bio. And once you purchase it within five business days, sorry, it'll direct you to uh, message me. We'll get in detail about your goals, and within five business days, I'll have it sent to your email. Do check ins weekly, plan changes monthly. No, no um, contract. You can stop whenever you want. All based on you, your specific goals, starting points, injuries, all that. If you're dealing with RA, that means you have a lot of inflammation in the body. You have to stop eating inflammatory foods. Yellow Doc's great for inflammation. Ginger's great for inflammation. It's hard for me to see because it's so bright. Let's see. Yeah, if you're dealing with any like health problems, your best thing you can do is a detox along with fasting, which is what I combined in my 30 day detox and reset program. It's $35, so it's about a dollar a day. It lays it all out for you, how to fast, fasting protocol, what foods to eat, um, what herbs to take to detox your body completely, how to mix them, how to make them, where to get them. A lot of you ask where to get them. So I include all that in the 30-day detox and reset program. Links in the bio. So you can cleanse and detox your kidneys, your liver, your cells, right add oxygen to your cells your colon your pancreas all of that so yeah links in the bio for the 30-day detox and reset program go around this way i'm just walking through random streets i don't even know where i'm at <laughs> just talking and walking Let's 
see, let's see. Keep commenting y'all's questions. Again, no topic at hand today. I'm just literally got on just to help y'all out, give back, give you some free advice, respond to your questions personally. I'm on a live, so I'm doing my best to catch every comment. Hawaii says, how do I do a one-on-one -on -one with you by phone? The only program that I offer one-on-one -on -one, uh, phone calls is the one-on-one -on -one healing consultation. That link is in the bio. In my profile bio, you go to my profile, you click the link. Again, TikTok will ask you, are you sure you want to leave TikTok? You hit yes. You'll see the one-on-one -on -one healing disease consultation. That one, we hop on a phone call for up to an hour. That's also a year program. So you get access to me for a year. Call me on the phone whenever you need. Text me. You have my personal number, this phone that I'm on right now. Text me whenever you need. Call me whenever you need. Send me voice messages, whatever you need. And that comes with custom everything, meal plan, grocery list, preserves to mix based on what you're dealing with. Any health issue at all. You've seen I posted testimonials of clients who no longer have diabetes, clients who no longer have cancer, clients who no longer have fibroids, no longer have internal cysts, back to having a regular um, intercourse, back to feeling better, no longer having kidney issues. I posted a client testimonial of that. Um, no longer have anxiety, no longer have de depression. Hundreds of clients I posted that no longer have the virus because they came to me with the panic and told them what to do. They're completely fine. Never had to go to the hospital or anything. Um, so, yeah, that's the one-on-one -on -one healing consultation program. It's 320. That's full year. Phone calls with me. Text me. Whatever you need. And I map it all out based on what you're dealing with. That's for really specific issues. Or if you just want to be able to speak to me on the phone and really get that one-on-one -on -one, uh, feeling. Yeah, hypertension, blood pressure, all that. If you're looking to detox the body, that's the detox and reset program. Glamour Flower 99. But the best way to detox is going to be having the right combination of herbs, drinking a lot of water, specific fasting protocol, all of that. So, yeah, if you have questions about the detox, you can message me on Instagram. Same name, T Walk the Hawk Fitness. Message me on here. I'll get to it as soon as I can. But TikTok is like messing with my messages. Like that's why I'm being so slow at getting back the messages right now. Because when you all DM me, I'll see like the first, you know, three words of the message and I'll click it and it'll just be blank and all white. And then I'll click accept. And it will be blank still. So I'll, have, I'll like respond to the message with like a period. Then I have to go out and find your message again. And then it will show what you messaged me. So I've updated it. I don't know what's going on. So that's why I'm being really slow at getting back to messages right now. It's annoying. But I'm doing my best. Let's see. If you're feeling cold and flu-like symptoms... Elderberry is going to be your best bet. You can take oil of oregano. Kiwi is great. It's the highest in vitamin C. Um, and coconut. Eating a real brown coconut, the inside, and then drinking the water out of it. If you can't get your hands on that, drink a bottle a day at least of uh, harm, harmless harvest coconut water. Lots kind of did today, I just realized. Not that many people in here, but that's fine. Whoever's in here, I'm here to help. I always have bad service when I walk around too, so hopefully y'all are hearing everything I'm saying. It says good service.
No, gummies are never any good. Stop dealing with gummies. Multivitamin gummies, elderberry gummies. You're not getting what you think you're getting from gummies. And most of the time there's pork in them anyway and a bunch of other nonsense. Stop taking gummies to get vitamins and minerals. Do not do that. The only capsules or I guess pills you should be taking is if it's a, a capsule, a vegan capsule filled with actual ground up powder of whatever it is. If you're getting elderberry, you're not getting it in tea form or making it yourself, then you should be getting the elderberry capsules that are filled with the ground up elderberry in it. Stop dealing with gummies. I don't worry about how much protein I'm getting daily. I do not track that. People get too hyped up on protein. You do not need protein. You need amino acids. When you have the right amount of amino acids, your body actually uses that to create its own protein, right? Because the fact that people think that you need protein is the reason why so many people are sick. Because when you have high protein, which people think you need to build muscle, then guess what? It damages your kidneys. And then when your kidneys damaged, you're also eating acidic foods that are harmful for you. So now you're eating acidic foods, your kidney's damaged, so it's not regulating those acids correctly like it would normally, even though it's not normal to have to regulate that much acid in the body. So now the acids run wild throughout your body. Now you have systemic acidosis, which is exactly what an autoimmune disease is, right? Any type of autoimmune issue you're dealing with, that is systemic acidosis, meaning you have too much acid running wild in your body, which is why when you go to a doctor and they diagnose you with an autoimmune issue, either coinciding with that or months down the line, they're going to say, oh, we regret to inform you. We also noticed that your kidney's malfunctioning. But the whole time they have it backwards. It's not the kidney that's malfunctioning because of the autoimmune issue. The kidney is already the primary reason for the autoimmune issue because it's not regulating the acids now the acids are running wild in your body right but this is what your doctor will tell you and i don't know what i'm talking about because i don't have a white lab coat on or a phd and a plaque on my wall saying that i went and studied the same courses that have been killing people for years and not curing or healing anyone just putting them on pills so i don't know what i'm talking about <laughs> You're signing up today. Okay, great. You're going to be the next client testimonial that I post daily. Y'all see the client testimonial I posted last night. One of my clients, she's been going hard. She came to me with the virus. Was worried just like everybody. We knocked that out. She came to me with severe anxiety, depression. We knocked that out. No pills, no prescriptions, naturally. She came to me wanting to lose weight, drop body fat. She's dropping body fat. She's down 10 pounds in the first month. That testimonial, I think, is the newest video on my page. And these are the videos, messages, emails I wake up to daily for five months straight, nonstop, every day. If you tell me, yo, pay attention to the questions, I'll block you because what that means is you're disrespecting my time because I'm spending my free time to answer questions. So if you feel I'm not answering your specific question, then that's because I'm ranting by answering someone else's question in as much detail as possible. So in that time that I'm answering someone else's question, I'm going to miss some of your questions. So if that's an issue, I'll throw a block party, right? Because I come in here to spend my free time helping you all, right? So if you feel like I owe you anything and you want to comment, yo, answer questions, stop ignoring questions, then you'll no longer get access to these questions that I'm answering in the future and now. <laughs> How do you help with diabetes? I've already posted 
many client testimonials, clients who had diabetes and no longer have it. Right? But I don't know what I'm talking about. Do not know what I'm talking about. And again, it depends on the type of diabetes you have. If you have type 1, type 2. If you have type 1, you're probably on insulin still. But as I've talked about in the past, juiced string beans equal a specific amount, typically one cup, equals the amount of insulin that most people are taking throughout the day. But it all depends. Everyone's different. That's why when it gets to specific things like that, we do the um, one-on-one healing consultation program so we can hop on the call, figure out how long you've been dealing with it, how severe it is, what's going on. Right, because we want to make sure that you are not having to get your leg amputated, that you are not losing your eyesight. Because people with diabetes just think, hey, that's just going to be me one day. That's what it is. The doctor told me I can't do anything about it. He has me on insulin and all these pills, and there's nothing I can do about it. I've got to wait until it's my time. But that doesn't have to be the case. That's what you'll see like in my comment section. This guy doesn't know what he's talking about. He's saying you can heal this, you can heal this. Um, I've been dealing with it for 20 years, so I know you can't heal it. <laughs> You've been dealing with it for 20 years because your doctor told you you couldn't heal it, so you gave up and believed that you can't heal it. So now you're in the same situation, yet worse. Probably lost a leg by now. You're probably losing your eyesight. All because you have no belief in being able to heal things naturally and because your doctor drilled it into your head that this is your life now. I regret to inform you, you have this. It's incurable. There's nothing we can do about it. I'm just going to put you on this insulin. I'm going to put you on this medication. You got cancer. I'm going to put you through this radiation. Let's cross our fingers and just hope we can slow this down and you can live a few more years or another decade or so. And... You know, be able to say your goodbyes to your friend, like, yo, <laughs> this is ridiculous. Yeah, there's plenty you can do for eyesight. There's plenty you can do. Any question you ask, is there anything we can do for this? I have tons of clients, testimonials. I did five phone consultations yesterday, five-hour phone consultations yesterday with new signups for the one-on-one healing consultation program. Link is in my profile bio. Every single one of them, of course, I keep everything private. Every single one of them dealing with something different. Could be eyesight, could be kidney failure, could be diabetes, could be cancer, could be whatever. You get on the phone, figure it out, how to plan things in five days. And then that's when you see the dramatic testimonials that I've been posting. I want to thank this guy. He saved my life. I no longer have diabetes. I want to thank this guy. He saved my life. I no longer have cancer. I want to thank this guy. He saved my life. I no longer have hypertension, high blood pressure. I'm no longer on medication. I'm no longer taking anxiety medication. Like, don't make this shit up. And just, I give you the info. You do what you do with it. I give you the game plan. You follow it. All I'm doing is giving you the knowledge. You put the work in. You follow what I tell you. And it just so happened that that, that ends up producing results and client testimonials for me to share to show other people that it's possible. But, hey, I'm just doing what I do, and this is why I do what I do. Because when I wake up in the morning, I see these testimonials, these emails, the messages, the videos that I post to clients. That's what keeps me going. That's what I feel my reason for being on this earth is. People be like, yo, you got to be careful, man. The information you're sharing, they're going to kill you. That's fine. The information I'm putting out, if I put it out and all you that listen to it and view my videos, you take it in, they can't kill us all. So (laughs) at least I got the information out. Now they knock me out. Hopefully one of y'all save my videos or y'all start making your own videos, spreading the message of the same stuff I was teaching. 
and the future can get better because I don't put too much into this existence, right? This is, I don't know, you call this life, but is it really life? Because there'd be a lot of death going on in this life, a lot of miserable things going on in this life, right? But we know energy never dies. So even when someone dies, the energy never leaves. So I don't want to get too deep into metaphysics and things like that because I'm into all that. I could make a whole separate page just doing videos on metaphysics and quantum physics, quantum mechanics and all that. Because that's what I like watching my free time. That's why I'm weird. Because <laughs> I'd be thinking on a whole nother damn realm. <laughs> but yeah anyways I'll put the info out there it is what it is cause we see we can go down the list of 70 to 100 plus holistic healers and doctors that just all of a sudden get sick all of a sudden die and all of a sudden this that is it maybe a coincidence who knows who knows? It don't seem like it, though, but. Thank y'all. Thank y'all for the support. Thanks, One Day 250. Thanks again, Glamour Flower 99. I don't recommend fish, typically, if you are eating fish. I'll, um, you will go with salmon. It's a nice day. It's a nice day. If you are eating fish, go with the salmon. But you got to be careful with the fish. High in mercury, high in heavy metals. When you have heavy metals in the body, it can result in a lot of health issues. Pretty much anybody who's dealing with any disease has a high amount of a specific type of heavy metal. Heavy metals you get from chicken is cadmium. A lot of people have high, high cadmium. Heavy metals you get from fish is mercury, right? But we can go on and on and on. A lot of people have a lot of aluminum in the body. You're getting a lot of aluminum from the soy products. So just because you're vegan and not eating meat, don't think you're doing something good because you're getting a lot of aluminum from the soy. As I talked about before, when you have high aluminum in your body, you typically end up with mental issues, anxiety, depression, um, Alzheimer's, dementia, things like that. So we want to watch that. Good alternative to bread. Good alternative to bread is you can still have bread, but you want to stay away from the white flour, from the wheat and all that. You just get spelt. Spelt or amaranth is what I recommend. Because we know the white, the wheat, flour, all of that. It's high in acid. And there we go again, putting tons of acid in the body, which is right where disease lives and grows. Right? So if you're eating bread, get spelt or amaranth bread. But just because it says spelt on the label, turn that thing around and look at the ingredients because it might say spelt real big on the front and you turn around and say spelt. Let's say white flour, uh, this gum, da, 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 all these weird ingredients. That is not spelt bread. It just says spelt bread for marketing because they know some of us are getting a little more knowledgeable. So, okay, they're looking for spelt bread. We're going to give them spelt bread, all right? They're going to see spelt real big on the label. But they ain't going to turn that shit around. We're still going to make that sale and make that profit and still keep them sick. I was in, um, hummus is typically good. It's just chickpeas, which is the only bean I recommend. Garbanzo beans, chickpeas, that's the only bean you should be putting in your body. Um, I was saying something. Oh, I was in the grocery store. I just be in the grocery store sometimes for half hour, hour, just reading labels. I'll get what I need, and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to stick around and just read labels. 
I was in the bread section. They literally had like 30 different brands and types of bread. And I'm just flipping them all around. And out of, let's say, 30 of the brands and types of different grains and multi-grains and wheat and whole and organic, this and that, out of 30 of the brands, 28 of, maybe 20, 28 out of the 30 had soy in them or milk. <laughs> like, yo, this is ridiculous. No wonder people were like have no idea. Like when I be talking, you be panicking. It's like, what the hell do I eat? Because like, this is what's going on. Out of 30 different types of bread in this bread aisle, 28 of them, 28 out of the 30 had milk or soy in them. Why does that need to be in bread? Right? Even the ones that you think are healthy, even the organics, the multigrains, the whole grains, the wheats, all of that, still nonsense in them. Because they do everything they can to get that soy in the system. Hmm. That soy is messing up your thyroid. That soy is lowering estrogen in women. That soy is raising estrogen in men. We already know what the milk's doing. Why does a filter? I feel like a filter keeps going on my video. Yeah, soy in your chocolate, soy in your your whatever, like literally everything. Just walking, answering questions, going on different topics. Again, a lot of you, if you're just joining. Been getting a lot of comments on my videos asking how to sign up for coaching. So a real quick rundown. Now I'm going to get into some more questions. You just click the link in the bio on my profile. It'll say, are you sure you want to leave TikTok? You click yes. Go to my secure website. It's 40 for one month or the special I'm running is 80 for three months. So you get a whole month free. Custom everything. Meal plan, grocery list, workouts for the gym or at home. We do check-ins weekly. Plan changes monthly if you choose to continue, but it's no contract at all. You stop whenever you want. I have the plan to you within five business days of receiving your goals after you process payment. And you'll be the next client testimony I post daily. You can shoot me a message too. Shoot me a message say, look, you can sign up for coaching if you want. If you don't want to just go through the website. You want to like make sure first, I don't know. And this street's kind of loud. I'm just staying on streets where I know my service is good. Because when I go on that other block where I really like to walk, it's nice and quiet and calm. It's a little bit of shade, but still getting some sun. Um, I always lose service. Right now I'm near this, it's like a school, and they're like, got all these trucks out digging, so dust keeps getting in my eye. If you see me keep going like this. Um, it's good for thyroid. I already talked about that. Bladder rack is the best herb for thyroid in combination with some other things. So again, if you're dealing with really specific things like that, it's hard for me to just give you, all right, these are the two things you should be taking because it's going to be different depending on how long you've been dealing with it, how severe it is, what the symptoms are. That's why I started the... The healing consultation program. I hate this street. Cleaning the street and just throwing dust in my face. I said, have my mask on. I ain't even got my mask on me. No, I didn't say anything about keto bread being good. Uh, Brussels sprouts are good. I just did five consultations yesterday. I was on the phone a lot yesterday.
just tuned in how do we get more info about your plans and what's offered click the link on my profile you click that link TikTok's gonna ask you, are you sure you wanna leave TikTok? You hit yes. You'll see the drop down for custom coaching, for the holistic healing, one on one consultation, for the detox program. You click them, and all the details are there, and you'll be good to go. The first consultation for the healing program is up to an hour. Oh yeah, I never wear a mask unless I have to. But I'm saying in situations where there's dust flying and it's getting in my lungs, that's when I should have a mask on. Not just scared to walk by people in everyday life. Like <clears throat> it's like y'all see me walking. As I'm walking, what you don't notice is I'm walking past people. And as they're walking past me, they like switch all the way to the other side of the sidewalk. They see me like, oh shoot. Like, yo, y'all don't even know. I'm probably the best person you want to walk past. <laughs> I'm the best person you want to walk past today. So you might catch me saying some shit that you're dealing with. So they're less comfortable walking past me without a mask. But whole time walking past walking past tons of super unhealthy people with a mask, thinking that that's saving them. It's a weird concept. Right? Because we have to be honest. When you're super high body fat, which usually equates to poor diet. Guess what that's gonna equal? Weak immune system. When you have a weak immune system, you're more likely to catch a virus, a cold, a flu, anything like that, right? But yet, you think putting this mask on is going to keep you from getting sick. But then you pull the mask down and you put pepperoni pizza and burger in it. Like, it doesn't make sense. Think about it. I don't know. I'm just walking. I ain't got no tracker or anything. I just walk, run for hours at a time sometimes. I'm like, you know what? I'm going on a walk today. Let me go live, answer some questions. Because y'all know normally I come on with a specific topic at hand. I just go in. Sometimes I show y'all research documents, pretty much do a whole damn slideshow for you. And other times I just get on and I just let y'all spark my mind. I go off the top. I go off of the top because I really do this. I'm not one of these dudes who just, all right, I'm going to do a video on how to help people. Um... Let's say, get their blood pressure down. All right, hold up. Let me Google this. Okay. So that says that'll help with blood pressure. That says that'll help with blood pressure. Okay. Best way to get rid of blood pressure. <laughs> That's how a lot of people are doing. It. That's why I realize y'all like when I go live, because you realize, oh, shoot, this dude can actually talk for hours and hours, <laughs> nonstop on different topics off the top, and go in detail to help me out, because I really do this, right? No nonsense, no bullshit, no faking it till I make it. I actually make it happen. Make y'all make it happen. I give you the knowledge, I give you the game plan, you get the results. Shout out to all y'all ordering. I see the notifications popping up on top of my screen. So as soon as I get off of this throughout the day, get to y'all, get your goals. If you're doing the consultation program, get you scheduled in so we can hop on the phone. Because, again, a lot of you, you want to speak on the phone. The only program that offers that is the one-on-one -on -one healing consultation program. The standard custom coaching, you do not get my phone number. So don't order that and then be upset that we didn't get on the phone.
And then also, when you're giving me the details of your goals, please let me know if you are vegan, if you're vegetarian, if you want to try the alkaline uh, vegan diet, if you're pescatarian, if you eat meat, because a lot of you will order. <clears throat> and you have to realize most of my clients are not vegan, right? Even though that's all that I teach for the most part. Most of my clients aren't there yet, and they may be taking steps to transition. So, with that being said, I still give them the healthiest options based on what diet they subscribe to, and I throw in a bunch of free information in case they want to transition. But if they choose to do another month, a lot of times they're like, hey, I'm ready to switch over to what you've been talking about. This is great. I lost weight, but now I want to really focus on internal health. Let me do an alkaline diet this following month, right? So I say that to say, here's a good topic we can talk about. What's what's the difference, right? Because I realize a lot of people don't know the difference. I had a client, a few clients actually last week, message me their goals. I follow a um, vegetarian diet, right? So I'm like, okay, you follow a vegetarian diet. This is what you want, blah, blah, blah. And then I send them it. They're like, I thought that this wasn't good or you don't recommend this. I'm like, yeah, I recommend an alkaline diet. You said that you're not, my assumption was you're not ready for that. You didn't want a vegan or an alkaline vegan diet. You said vegetarian. Like, oh, my mistake. I didn't know the difference, right? So the difference is if you're vegetarian, that means typically you're still eating eggs. You're still eating dairy things like that. If you're pescatarian, you're still eating shellfish, you're still eating fish, salmon, things like that. If you're vegan, you're no longer eating any animal product. So you're not eating any um, any meat of any form. You're not eating any fish. You're not eating any dairy. You're not eating any eggs. If you're alkaline vegan, that's when we get take it to another level. We're not eating typically hybrid foods. We're not eating mucus forming foods. We're not eating inflammatory um, causing foods. We're not eating um, genetically modified foods. We're not eating impossible meat, right? So there's different levels. So hopefully that's a good breakdown so you understand the difference, right? And again, somebody said, I wish I could find alkaline water not in plastic bottles. Again, I showed you the lot the other day. I had a plastic bottle. When you have plastic bottles, make sure that they say BPA free. So it's okay if it's in a plastic bottle if it's BPA free, bisphenol A. That's what you want to look for. But you can't find that. Do the again, take steps, do the best you can. If you're on the move. Go to the grocery store, you're short on time, and all they got is plastic bottles. Make sure it's 100% spring water. And go from there. Take steps. Take steps. Pasta and tomato sauce. Your typical pasta isn't good for you, Italian acid. Tomato sauce is not good for you. Because your tomato sauce is never made from the right tomato. It's made from the big tomatoes, the normal standard tomatoes, which are high in lectins, which cause digestive issues. And we can go on and on about tomatoes. You should only be eating cherry or plum tomatoes, which your tomato sauce is never made of. So watch out for that. But you can get spelt pasta. You can get quinoa pasta. But you still don't want to put the tomato sauce on it because, again, that's going to be bad for your digestive system and for other things, which I've covered in a video about a month ago on my page. Uh, no, you shouldn't be cooking with vinegar. You should be. When it comes to oils, I did a video on that, too. You should be cooking with grapeseed oil, uh, sesame oil. That's the only ones you should be applying heat to. 
Do not cook with coconut oil and things like that. Because when you bring them to a certain temperature, they're no longer good for you. But, um, yeah, keep commenting y'all's questions, though. I think I'm about to walk home now. What time is it? I don't even be paying attention to the time. 12.30 my time. So it's 12.30. Only thing I'm putting in my system so far is water. Just water. I'm going to go home and have a kale, apple, ginger, parsley, juiced, juice, right, made, you know, with a, a pressed juicer. And that'll be my first meal of the day. And um, go from there. It's like I stopped seeing y'all's comments. It's weird. It like goes in the wrong order. Let's see. One second. But yeah, I forget what we was even talking about. I was looking for more comments, but yes, water fasting is great. Getting groceries today, one item I should have on my list. Um, I mean, I should have more than, I can give you more than one. You can have your, your red kale, your red onion, your mangoes, coconut, coconut water if you can't find coconut. Um, what else? Apples. Typically, any type of apple is fine, except for um, Granny Smith apples because they're higher in acid. So you want to stay away from those green, sour apples. Um, what else? Grocery list. Mushrooms. All except shiitake. You can use that as your meat substitute. Your 100% spring water. Right? You can add pink Himalayan salt to it or key lime to make it alkaline. So you don't have to pay extra for the alkaline water that they probably just made with chemicals anyway. And just charge you more for it. Um, just going off the top of the head. Name some fruits. Name some veggies. You can do zucchini, cucumber. You could do as fruits, veggies. I gave you mushrooms as a meat substitute. You can get walnuts and get a food processor and make them into a meat substitute. You want your walnuts high in selenium. Right, which is good if you have diabetes. It's also good for eyesight. Um, Brazilian nuts, great for you. Also high in selenium. Um, so what I just gave you, nuts, fruits, veggies, meat substitute. You can do jackfruit as a meat substitute. Uh, what else? So I gave you meat substitutes, veggies, fruits. Gave you the water, how to make it alkaline. Seeds or grains, you can do your quinoa, of course. Hemp seed, complete source of protein. Quinoa, complete source of protein, meaning all nine essential amino acids. Um, what else? What else? What else? Just off the top. What, are, what else? Um, if you want beans, garbanzo beans, chickpeas, that's the only beans you should be dealing with. All other beans are horrible for you and almost impossible for your body to digest. So yeah, if you're missing any of this and I went too quick for you, subscribe to the YouTube, youtube.com slash twalkthehawk. You can rewatch this. I'll have the replay updated, uploaded on my YouTube page by the end of the day. Face it, I'm lit. Yeah, watch that replay there. That's the testimonial I posted last night. It's the newest video on my page. Shout out to her getting it in. She's in the live right now. Tell them what's up. Tell them what's up. 
yeah, you can teas, you can do um, ginger tea, raspberry tea is great, hibiscus tea is good. Um, echinacea is good. Let's see. What else? Yeah, I'm just reading the comments. Somebody said they live right next to me. Pull up, pull up. Come out on your balcony right now and say what's up. What is up? What is up? Where you at? Where you at? <laughs> I'm not flirting, but you're super handsome. Thank you for the compliment. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, face it, I'm lit. Alkaline diet changed my life again. One of my supporters, clients in the live, letting y'all know what's up. She told you what's up. No longer has anxiety. No longer has depression. No longer has the virus. Lost 10 pounds. All in a month. Keep him pushing. Keep him pushing. Uh, don't deal with shiitake mushrooms. Okay, so apparently there's there's 10 people in this live that live right next door to me. So, okay. <laughs> That's funny. I think we got some trolls. If you live next door, pop out right now. I'm on the corner. Where you at? <laughs> Right, I live next door to everyone, apparently. I said, wait, how did she get rid of all that? Face it, I'm lit. They said, how did you get rid of all that? What you mean? She signed up for coaching, gave it a game plan, knocked it out. Facts. Correct the alkaline diet, correct the herbs, doing the right things. Yeah, so any of y'all signing up, I see the notifications popping up. Again, I'm going to get to y'all. If you can, to speed up the process, go ahead and message me your goals. Direct message me your goals here on TikTok. In detail, anything that's missing, I'll be sure to ask you. That way I can have it to you within five business days. And I'm going to get to all y'all as soon as I get off this live. Yeah, no, no need for your son to be on pills. Again, I come from all that. I have hundreds of clients who deal with that, who no longer deal with it. I'm going to take some of these... Uh these leaves, some big ass leaves. 